so I was thinking how many kilowatts do you really need to have fun how many kilowatts are necessary to be able to really get on it and not feel limited by the amount of power you know do you need uh, 12 kilowatts like that you can max out a stock motor with do you need 15 do you need 30 35 how much do you need so on my favorite trail here I was uh, trying to look at the telemetry from the EBMX app and uh, it's kind of difficult to do while you're riding I don't want to have an incident so I decided to do a screen record of the EBMX app uh, which I'll put up on the screen now and uh, what I realized is uh, you need to kind of put it together with a video from the ride so this is my favorite trail I'm going to show how many kilowatts I'm using riding this trail uh, I did it before and I maxed out at 17.8 so we'll see where it's at now uh, keep in mind it's been unusually dry here for many days so the trail is kind of uh, sandy instead of nice thick dirt so less traction so gotta kind of be careful but we'll show how many kilowatts we actually use on a trail ride like this the opposite direction again like I said uh, you know, this is the same place I shot the other video about the sound at uh, it's been really dry so now it's sandy not so much traction and I got to be kind of extra careful so uh, anyway run it back the other way and see what kind of kilowatts we're using uh, before I saw a maximum of 17 By the way, I'm nowhere near a full battery. As you can see, uh, I'm at 85 volts, 73% on my uh, 22S battery. So, but that doesn't really matter for this run because uh, it's not going to, uh, you know, I'm not limited anyway by the power. And, and it's, it's kind of interesting for you guys. guys. We're, We're still recording here, yet. Yeah. Uh, anyway, it's, it's interesting, interesting, I think, for you guys uh, running 72 volt batteries, because you can see I'm kind of near uh, what you would be full with a 72 volt. So let's run that one more time while nobody's here and just see what kind of power we're using on the bike for, no, I'd say spirited uh, trail riding.
run it back uh, other direction one more time quick and uh, quickly and then uh, I'll give my thoughts Okay, so that's a couple quick runs on my favorite local trail here. Uh, just want to say, I was, uh, I mentioned in the other video, I've got 12, uh, 12, 19, and 28 kilowatts setting on the bike. Um, 19 and 28, both, I feel like I can't even use all the power here. 12, I definitely hit the limit on 12 kilowatts, and I even noticed that on the telemetry. So 12 limits it a little bit. Uh, what's my conclusion? Well, I don't know how much I pulled on those runs, but when I did the telemetry previously, uh, maximum I hit was 17.8 kilowatts. And that is absolutely more than enough for this kind of riding. Uh, weight obviously matters. I'm a pretty solid dude at 90 kilograms, close to 200 pounds. So um, for me, 17.8 is more than enough. I mean, for 90% of what you're doing this kind of riding, it's great uh you know 25 30 35 is great i'm debating about uh you know upgrading this build to 35 kilowatts with an xlb60 and p45 cells obviously it's not needed <laughs> it's got more than enough at 29 but uh anyway just thought it'd be interesting kind of get an idea how much power i'm using on uh, this kind of a trail ride and honestly i think 17 16 18 for 90% of what you're doing is more than enough to have fun. So that's it. Thanks for watching.